So a week or two ago, I made a video titled Why Bug Snacks Will Be a Masterpiece. In that video, I explained why Bug Snacks had a controversial announcement and why I think will be a masterpiece. Then, to my surprise, a week later, a brand new Bug Snacks gameplay trailer was released. Today, I'm going to be breaking down that trailer and figuring out what Bug Snacks is really all about. In this brand new gameplay trailer, we find out that you're playing as a reporter whose next big lead is Bug Snacks in Snacktooth Island. While on the island, you help the townsfolk with their jobs and tasks. We even get a look at a few new traps. Now, this may look like an innocent game at first, but as we get deeper into the trailer, things take a darker turn. Well, say you do find these Bug Snacks and make it back alive. You just might keep your job. Now get going and try not to fall off a cliff. This one segment shows so little yet so much. First of all, it proves that this game is much darker and deeper than most initially thought. And this is huge for the game, because it may actually pique people's interest into getting the game. When watching the trailer, you can really tell that there is a full story behind the game. The main premise of the game so far seems to be just help the islanders out and bring more people to Snacksburg. I believe the darker elements of the game will reveal themselves as the story progresses. What I find really interesting about this final bit of the trailer is seeing that giant pizza butterfly bug snack. This leaves me to believe that there are actually going to be enemy bug snacks that can attack you. I'd never thought about this before, but the idea of dangerous bug snacks is really amazing. Imagine being out in the wilderness, hunting for a rare bug snack, and out of the corner of your eye, you see it. As you sit there, stalking your prey, you hear shuffling in the bushes. You look to your left and see a giant enemy spider. <laughs> I mean, the giant enemy bug snack. That would add a whole new level of fear to the game that would make this game so much fun to play. Sorry for the shorter video, but that's all I have. If you enjoyed, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe. I would very much appreciate it. Later.